Welcome my dear viewers. In this video, I will show you, how to upgrade to Windows 11, for unsupported devices. As you see, this device, got an update to Windows 11, but actually when you try to upgrade, you get this message. And the upgrade will fail to start. This device already joined to a domain, and the same steps, will be done for devices standalone. The only difference here is that, this device takes updates from a dedicated server for the update process. The alert message says that, the processor isn't supported because it is not generation 8. As you see it is generation 3. The second thing TPM is not version 2. And as you see it is version 1.2. Also an important thing, the device must have UEFI and secure boot. If you want to see, how the conversion was done from legacy to UEFI, watch this video on my channel. The link on the description box below, and now appears on the upper right corner of the screen as suggested videos. And make sure, you switch to secure boot. And now let's start the upgrade process but before this, if this is the first time you visit my channel, subscribe to my channel, and activate the notification bell, to be notified of new videos. When you google for ways to install Windows 11, you will get this article from Microsoft official website. This article tells you, how to start to upgrade for devices not meet the minimum requirements for Windows 11. And there is a caution to not use it, and if you wish to do that, it will be your responsibility. And maybe you will not be able to get updates in the future. So far there is no problem, my device receives updates, as usual as you will see at the end of this video. So it depends on your decision, and only you responsible for this risk. If you agree and, still interested to upgrade, follow the steps to the end of this video. Copy this path, I will leave it in the description box below. Navigate to registry editor, and run it as administrator. Paste the path, and hit enter. Under Mozatube, create a new DWORD32 key. Name it, allow upgrade with unsupported TPM or CPU, I will leave it in the description box below, copy and paste it. And its value is 1. Let's return to the update window, and click retry. This time, the upgrade process will bypass the TPM version, and CPU. Click fix issue. And it will caution you again if you agree, accept the upgrade process. After installation, the device will ask you to restart, to finalize the upgrade, click restart.
check Windows 11 version. Check my apps and shortcuts, all fine. And now, I will check for updates. As you see, the updates work fine, I will install updates. After installing all updates, restart the PC. I will check now updates history. As you see, all updates needed for Windows 11, were installed successfully. I hope this video helpful for you. Don't forget to share, subscribe, like, and turn on the notification bell. Thanks for watching.